What is up ladies and gents, we are back. I'm the Guitarist562 and I do video game guides and walkthroughs. And in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make an insane amount of Solent. So if you guys didn't already know, when you do dynamic events, which are these events on the map, you can actually get a lot of money. You can either do the peace event, but that doesn't give you Marins. So two things you can get is Marins to sell or Marins to use. Personally, since most of my stuff is already upgraded, I like to go to these Dominion events, even though you may not be very effective at reaching like the top 10, just contributing two or five materials will place you into three different teams, either red, blue, or green, and then it'll send it to your mailbox, the level of effort that you had, and the better you do, obviously you'll get more. But look, I got three precious Marins for turning in about two or five items. And next, you can just go into the merchant and you can sell all these items. So I have two right here, but I think I, ha I haven't opened the box yet. Yeah, try right here. So uh, three right here. And you have two choices depending on what the market value is at the moment. So by instantly selling this, I can get 2,160,000 Solent for about three to five minutes of effort versus doing so much effort in an abyss dungeon which is like right here these are these open world dungeons where people will tell you to go to uh Cilius and farm open world which is good early game but late game most of the stuff here doesn't sell for much as you can see when you go to the marketplace you go here materials and it sells for seven loose in a piece so is it really worth to sell seven or you can just sell other things for that's you know over 10 and then just sell this for Solent. So another way to make substantial amount of money is to sell the other materials that you don't use. I would basically keep these until you've outlived its use. For example, use these to level up your skills to plus five or your omnipotent skills and this to get your weapons to plus nine. The next two things is debatable whether you want to keep these. As you saw in the market, they're these are selling for three loose in a piece and then but early game these will sell for a lot like for example this could sell for like 80 to 100 maybe even more maybe thousands um but yeah but not like let's say i, I put these up these are each worth 288,000 solent that's gonna give me 864 let's just do one a piece one same thing one and the same thing 288 but now let's just sell everything and look what how much money i can potentially make i'm not going to sell it all i'm just showing you what you could potentially make by selling this and this is also from the from the event merchant as well so that's 7.4 million i'm at 1.8 million but that's not everything that can sell you can actually sell more stuff for example if you are done again emphasizing if you are done if you are done with all of your skills and you don't want to play other classes you can actually sell this parchment paper 1.6 million now these are the only items that really sell for anything for example if you look and scroll none of this really sells for much the lithographs don't really sell for much the weapons don't really sell for much this one sells for 109,000, but it's not much but the only things that do sell for a lot is if you get repeated mounts for example this one sells for 239 and i already have all these mounts and look i'm gonna sell all this 68 i don't need it anymore because i already have that mount but yeah that's just kind of like an intro guide on what sells for a lot so again i don't need none of this stuff because all of my gears for the most part plus nine as you can see so everything can be sold and everything's just for money this is just one of my builds but yeah you can either do that or do open world dungeons and spend an hour to make maybe 500 to a million solent or you could just spend five minutes and then just sell four Marins that you get from the dynamic events. Now you're not going to get it at every single event. It just, it's extremely um, relevant to which dominion event that you do. For example, let's say this dominion event talisman delivery. That's a good one. Blood mushroom. You'll probably get significantly less. So let's go ahead and look at my mailbox real quick and see, uh, let's see. Dark Destroyer's reward. I got three. Festival of Fire reward. I got four. Stop the Manor Frenzy reward. I only got the books because that was a peace event. Um, let's see. Dark Destroyer's reward again. Another three. Like, and that all adds up over time because you're going to need a significant amount of money to make Solent. But this is the best way to make Solent with the least amount of effort. And the last important thing is yes, you can do multiple events at once. But if you want to maximize making money, only do the PVP ones and try to be sneaky. Again, I would advise going into like a PVP build 
and then sneaking away like cloaked for example you have this and then you could just kind of like hide around and do your turn in get your two or five pieces in then leave the whole entire area so you can get maximize the amount of marines that you get per event you can do that and then the last one will be your guild event extremely sketchy sometimes because like i said you can get pk'd but this is the best way to get i'm talking you know five to ten million solent over the course of like a couple days for example this just for one event for three marines that's 1.5 million for five to ten minutes of effort now I'll pair that up every day that's about seven million and, and if you do multiple events a day for example let's see there's there's one you get three marines or two at uh, or let's say you get one at the low end, you'll get one, two, three, three Marins. On the high end, you'll get three, six, nine. The super, super high end, you'll get like four, as you saw in one of the boxes. It says four, eight, twelve. And you know, they each sell for 588,000. No, I'm 388. Let me double check. It sells for 432. So they dropped the price of what it used to sell for. But that's just an extra, a really cool tip and guide on how to make millions of solid quickly with the least amount of effort. But that's pretty much it. Hopefully that helped you get ready for release. But again, this stuff, before you sell this on release, you want to sell it for Lucent first. I'm talking about this is like you're completely done with all of your upgrades. But for events, if you're done, it makes a juicy amount of money. But thank you guys for watching. And as always, stay blessed.